here I am in Big Bear, California, where they have boating, fishing, sunshine, beautiful women. Unfortunately, I'm not here to cover any of those. Today, I'm here to see Big Bear's finest burrows. Now, the burrow is really one of nature's finest creations. It's got long silken ears, a delicately sculptured face, not to mention a perpetually pleasant disposition. It's no wonder the residents of Big Bear have made this lovable creature the hero of a most unusual sport, burrow baseball. The catch was, you had to ride the burrow around the bases, which is easier said than done. And the people in the outfield also had a little problem. They too had to be on a burrow before throwing the ball. When I finally came up to bat, all my fans wildly cheered me on to victory. One guy even offered to help me by exchanging my bat for his shovel. We both decided with all these burrows, he would need that shovel a lot more than I would. I was so excited, I went right past the burrow. And when I did get on my burrow, it went right past first base. He's going, he's going. It ain't that easy, lady. Just ask the outfielder who was demonstrating perfect burrow form while one of my teammates raced for home. The throw, the catch. Oops, don't worry about it. My teammate is still racing for home. Another teammate rounded second on her way to third, but this guy had obviously played with a burrow before. In spite of a throw that would have made Reggie Jackson green with envy, my teammate made it to third before the ball came. <laughs> Meanwhile, I was still trying to get my burrow back to first. Burrow baseball might be fun, but only for the burrow. It's got to be one of the most undignified sports around today.